Okay, so in this video, I'm going to show you how you can export your character creator free model to Blender. Then we're going to add Mixamo animations to it, and in the end, we're going to import it into Godot Game Engine. Okay, so after you finish with your with creating your 3D model, we're going to go to our content and inside pose we're going to choose our T pose which is the default okay now we're going to choose our model so 63 base plus and we're going to convert it to game base and we're going to create a multi-material and convert okay okay so after it finishes you can see we got a problem with the model shot so we're going to go to our edit mesh and scopes and we're just going to cover it up like that just a little bit okay and that's it and again edit mesh and now we're going to export it so we're going to file export and FBX loaded character and we're going to export it into Blender and we're going to uncheck embed textures and we're going to delete hidden faces and export it just give it a name and save it okay so now inside of blender we're going to go to our file and we're going to import our fbx file okay there it is so we're going to import fbx okay so after it's done importing we're going to go to our armature and we're going to choose our armature and to select everything we're going to just press A key and then we're just going to press the delete button and we're going to delete the bones okay so after that we're going to export it again export and we're going to export it as an FBX file and again give it any name you want so I'm going to call it Mixamo 1 and export it okay so inside Mixamo we're going to upload our character just move it over here okay so after finish uploading we're going to click next and just set it like that about here and click next okay and after it, after it finishes just click next next and we're going to give it an idle animation so idle then let's see 
okay let's just choose this idle animation and download it with the skin fbx 40 frames a second and none as a keyframe download and then again we're going to import it inside of blender to blender and we're going to create a new file so general and delete everything so and the camera okay now import the fbx file and inside of downloads going to choose the idle animation and again okay let's play the animation okay it's kinda slow but it still works okay so now we're going to export it as a GLTF file for Godot and again let's just call it CC3 to Godot and export it okay Now let's move the file inside a new folder Just move it to here So the documents and CC3 to get out Okay, after it finishes, we're going to our new folder and we're going to upload this GLB file and he, here is our character Okay, so to fix the eyelashes, we're going to go to CC Game Body and inside the mesh we're going to go to our surface 5 and inside the material we're going to go to flags and check the, transpa the transparent box and we're also going to go to our albedo and inside color we're going to make the alpha equal to 0 Okay, and that should be it. Let's see the animation. So, animation player, and we're going to make it a loop. Okay, so you can also use the blend shapes that you get that you get from the character creator free model. So if you go to CC game body and down here we got our blend shapes. So let me just stop the animation. And you can use the blend shapes in your code. So let's see if I move this one. You can open and close the mouth. His eyebrows. Let's see. You can open his lip. And you can make him blink also. And there are a lot in here so you can just play play around with it with it. Okay, so that's it. 
I hope you enjoyed this video don't forget to hit the like and subscribe button